Now to introduce the men who need no introduction. Cool. Oh, bit chilly today, isn't it, Bruce? Mm, mm, chilly. Your nipples are wrecked. I know. Must be chilly. You know what day it is? I believe I do. November 5th. Heating day. Heating day. Go on, mate. Warmth. Right. Warmth, warmth is key. Warmth for the school is key. Right, basically. Put a guy in there, turn on the heating. It's cold, a lot of cold students. Can't concentrate. Uh, huh. Right, Keith's down. But he got to proceed with the heat. It's what he would have wanted. Thousands of kids will freeze. It's all up to me, really. It's their life. It's their lives come first at the end of the day. At the end of the day, there. We don't want to see them from day after tomorrow, do we? That'd be a nightmare. Right, here's the button. What we're going to do is we turn the heating on now. <coughs> done. Job done. A warmer school. 214 more to go. Slippy. You got a bit hanging off there, by the way. The class is ready for Dora's lesson, but for some reason, he's absent. Learning. I got that. Do you know what Doran is? Yeah, Doran knows that. Is that free? Free? Oh, hey, hey, hey. Yes, boy. Yes, lad. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, boy. Wait, Doran's like that. Doran's like As seen previously, the site staff are a key role within the school, and as always, they're willing to share their engaging stories with us. Just show you, yep, yeah, cut that out, yeah. Hello there, site staff of the school, the caretakers, the policemen, the men in black, although we're in blue. Well, being the policeman of the school, you've always got regulations, um, you've always got to enforce. Hey, up! Stop! Stop! Anyway, I'm the head policeman of the school. Um, it's got its privileges, as you can see. My name's Paul Kettle, got my own initials on the front. Although, did get a little bit wrong. It's meant to be PK for Paul Kettle. Obviously, they put PC in there. He doesn't even wear his. Don't even wear mine. Don't even wear, Don't even wear it. What's the point? What is the point? They've got his so wrong. So wrong. And his name's Steve Fox. Steve Fox. But um, I'm the head policeman anyway. You're so. Policeman. Well, I am, so let's just. Cut that out later. The Mandems are a social group within school and always like to make an entrance. We have managed to catch a glimpse of the Mandems in mid banter. So I had to freeze, and uh, well, I'll let you off with a warning this time. Huh? 
No. Yeah. Are we on porn? Yeah, we're on porn. Alright. Fancy. Right. Boris, mate, I've got a bit of a problem with my car. What's wrong with your car? Try and look. What, so is it a problem? No, Bruce. Interior mirror? No. Paint job? It's not a paint, Bruce. Door? Not a door, Bruce. Boot won't shut. Not a boot, Bruce. Well, I mean, you slightly clipped it. There's a dent on the other side. There's a small dent. I clipped a tree on the way in. Bruce. That does it, yeah. You Does that explain it? You have a little bit. Careless. Careless driving. It's a cool autoglass for it. Auto yeah. Gavin from Autoglass will sort that out. Five minute job. I mean, um, it is only a chip, isn't yeah. it? The rest of it I can bash out. Yeah. Oh, yeah, right. we'll have that done. Oh, cheers, mate. Come on. It's alright. Don't worry about it. Let's get back to the computers. Well, basically what we've done is we've developed a sort of questionnaire based thing on the internet. All the students do Hack it, well, not hack into, but log into and um, write some comments about what they think of the IT staff at Bishop Stockford School. Um, we're taking all comments and we'll just, you know, we respond to them in a positive manner, hopefully. That the responses are good and we'll, you know, try and make a better life for the students at the computers of the school. I'll just read you one out that's um, come up. It's quite an important one for me. Um, Hi, Keith and Bruce. I'd like to smash your heads in again. Oh, that wasn't one of the ones I wanted to read. And um, you did an all right job, I guess. Positive. Well, I've got Excuse me, guys. So, guys? Yeah, I'll see you in a bit. Uh, guys, we're, we're doing an interview for, uh, you know, for a program about the IT technicians, the IT technicians at the school. Uh, about this? You did the documentary on the school? Yeah, I said. Oh, I've heard yeah. about that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. The so, IT technicians. Uh, the IT technicians. What can you tell me about them? Uh, bit of a joke. <laughs> what can you say? Bit of a joke, really, um, to be I'll honest. Tell you the guy with the vest <laughs> walked past me the other day, and he. The, the BO coming off that man is unbelievable. Is there not a, like a rule of hygiene in the school? Radiates, didn't he? That you radiates. Said, you said radiates. You know, do they do their job? No. They don't do their job. Are they virgins? Probably. Yeah. Um, um, what was that thing that you happened to you the other day? Oh, the, well, oh yeah, I was in C4 the other day, yeah? Listen to this. And basically I was sitting down, all of a sudden the IT technician that came in, I think his name's Keith, saying it's like 9-11. Uh, he went up to the projector, got out his spray, sprayed it, went away, left the room, you know. Afterwards I went up, got the spray. It's a can of links. Can of links. Olympics, like Olympics. Next 18. Next 18. The shop. Yeah. No, no, no. I think you mean on the field. Instead of sports day. No. We don't have a sports day. Yeah, but would it be sports thing? So is it sports or is it like down shops? No, like joking things. Oh, yeah. Well, we do the tray down, won't we? What? Yeah, we're going to do these. Every year always does a tray down. What? Every year always does a tray down. But anyway, we've got a theory now, so we've got to get off. Yeah, we've got to get off. Alright, see ya. Mr. Dunn, got your homework? Yeah, no, he has. He has. A new PE teacher has arrived at Bishop Stockford, and Mr. Dunn has been showing him around. We're born in a bar! Isn't it? Yeah, it's big, yeah. It's big. We had to have the roof raised for Dean. Kept it in his head. Still a bit big for Young though. We've got Young on pedigree pup food at the moment to let his bones grow until he's big enough to be released into the main sports hall. At the moment he's just in the gym. I'll give you the keys to his kennel later. <laughs> right, upstairs you've just seen the balcony. We shower every Thursday, you hang your laundry up there. Speaking of laundry, here's your complimentary PE shorts. Wear them in all weather, even when it's hailing. Don't take them off. Your first PE lesson's at three. Part two. Right. PE theory. Now what does it stand for? PE. I wonder. What does... Yes. Uh, is it pratting about? <laughs> Ha! Good one, Chandler. Good one. But no, it actually stands for... Foot. 
Borg, etc. Pay A. Now, moving on. I bet you've all wondered how a football wanders so majestically across the ground when in play, like so. Now, if we do the similar thing with a rugby ball, we will see a different result. Why? We see the football, it does a similar thing, like this. Now, a rugby ball seems to go like this. Why? PE theory. Now, lesson one, how to play football. You swing your foot. Lesson two, how to play badminton. You swing your arm. Lesson three. How to play rugby. Now this is where it gets difficult. You use both. What is that? What is that? PE theory. Oh, me and Grinal got proper wasted last night, mate. Yes, girls. Sit on my face. Oh, it's bright over there. Oh, yes, boss Fanzy. Timmy has been given the honour of being the school runner for a day. However, he has misinterpreted the role. Come in. <laughs> Where's Mike? I'm in. What? Facebook. Nice one, mate. That's mine. Um, now you've got into the chocolate. It's come out blank. <laughs> So then, how are you birds doing? My name's Keith, our tea technician, on Facebook. So then, uh, you girls ever received a poke on Facebook? Um, so what are we doing here? Well, we're here because I heard some rumours that this place is haunted. And uh, I'm just here to really check it out. So, um, try a bit of bloody something. Okay, do you want me to get the lights? Yeah, okay, fine. All right. Are you, are you ready? Bloody Doran. Bloody Doran. Bloody Doran. Mm -hmm. I'm not that loud, but it wasn't it? Mr. Tetley, the English teacher, is a very busy man, and we've managed to catch up with him for an exclusive interview. Hi there. Mr. Tetley's here, like the tea bag, get that quite a lot, 
and I'm one of the English teachers at the school and I like seeing a class, you know, I like taking them on from the start, seeing them improve, getting their ability up and, and leaving them when they're excellent. And uh, I've taught at quite a number of schools. Last school I was at, well, a bit of a joke. Um, you know, there's always a class thicky. Um, there was one guy called Ryan, you know the type, never picked up a thesaurus in his life, you know, doesn't know the difference between a metaphor and a simile. When I left him, he was like f***ing Shakespeare. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, Abby. Oh, it's a bit chesty. You right, Steve? Yeah, I'm alright. I've got some strepsils if you want. No, I'm alright. I'm alright. Anyway, being the police with the school, I've always got a lot of jobs. Um, you know, there's a lot of paperwork to, to fill in. Laws are always changing. Um, but we do play hard as well. You know, we go out on Fridays, um, we go to the donut store, have a few donuts, you know, eat it off. But, you know, we still keep our good figures. You can't tell, really. Okay, is, it good? <coughs> is there a fire? What? Is there a fire? No, there's not. not a fire. Well, then. Learn. What, what am I supposed to be learning? Just showing off in front of the camera. Right. Anyway, feel, yeah. yeah. Missed out the wet floor as well. At this school, um, we categorise students really in terms of English ability. At the top, you've got set one English, um, the really, you know, the top students. Below that, you've got set two, set three English. Below that is the, uh, is the point. Us English teachers like to call it the cliff, because that's where a lot of students tend to fall down on themselves. And below that, for the students who are really, really thick and are too stupid to learn their own language, they learn Bolshevik Russian. And they're never the students that are most popular in the playground, probably because no one can understand a word they're saying. You know, so I was, you know, second life, innit, you know? Yeah. I was like, Good! I was all right. Good! Using English outside the classroom. I like it. <laughs> Tell you what, though, Bruce. New iPhone, brilliant. brilliant FaceTime. So many things you can do on it. Get all the vapes. I mean, well, yesterday I was on, well, I don't, want to, say, I don't know what, oh, I don't want to say what I was on, but on. it was clear. I'll tell you that now. Um, Bruce. <laughs> what? Oh, crap. <laughs> You're an old crush, Bruce! Oh! 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 When you're ready. Three, two, one. Well, we're the IT technicians of the school basically. My name's Keith, he's Bruce. I see my job's paramount importance and you know, when there's a problem, we're the ones called out to help. Kind of like the Ghostbusters, isn't it? <laughs> we are Bruce, we are Bruce, you know. I mean, yeah, we like to have jokes oh, it's just important. like that. It's important, yeah. Keep the morale high, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. yeah, exactly. But you know, we all have our sayings, I have my models, you know. If there's a if there's a trouble, don't panic, stay on your seat, control up the lead, okay? I've got one as well. Um, if it's under the table, Right? It's a cable! It's a cable. It's a cable. Absolutely. <laughs> it's a cable. <laughs> <laughs> I <laughs> <laughs>
Are you alright? I meant to just slap my thigh and I got Are you alright? Sorry. Yeah, alright. Are you still alright? 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 Are even the real muppets will be thinking, shut it up now! Right! If you think you're good at book, no! Bruce, <laughs> mate! Bruce! Keith? Bruce, Keith! Saw that problem yet? What? What are you doing in here? The pressure's good on We are never gonna do this again. <laughs> It, they've got him so wrong. So wrong. Yeah, and his name's Steve Fox. <laughs> <laughs> I can't do it. Guys, <laughs> <laughs> you don't keep on doing it. It's so difficult. <laughs> it's not that. Anyway, uh, you're right, Steve. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> we got so. <laughs> you're right, Steve. Yeah. <laughs> Why are you laughing? This is so funny. A lot of cold students. Can't concentrate. Uh. <laughs> the point, really, us teachers like to call it the cliff. <laughs> <laughs> it's getting better, isn't it? <laughs>